Okay, so like right. Bonjour, bonsoir. C'est Planetly une autre fois. Et euh, ce euh, mardi, euh, c'est un euh, jour où il y a euh, des problèmes en Californie où euh, nous habitons ici, mais non euh, spécifiquement euh, San Francisco, mais euh, euh, les terres euh, plus nord, euh, euh, Mendocino, à San Norma, euh, il y a beaucoup de feux et beaucoup de films <laughs> et uh, c'est beaucoup de vent uh, aussi mais uh, San Francisco c'est uh, normal le um, le ah oui uh, <laughs> le fog est comme ça un peu de soleil. Um, alors, um, I speak in English. And now we have a, an esteemed guest uh, this evening, um, a filmmaker, a local filmmaker, a new filmmaker. Uh, not brand new, but he's on Vimeo. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I, I will uh, put up his Vimeo address. That was one thing. When we we're doing the live shows, we don't really have time to do so, so quickly. But we'll figure that out. Um, so, without further ado, I will introduce you to our guest, which is not me. <laughs> me too. But... Cesar. Uh, Armando. Uh, hello, Jennifer. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing okay. Has it been a couple of years since we've seen each other? It's been two years, actually. Yeah, it's been two years. And uh, yeah, it's, 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 it's great to see you. I've been, I've been wanting to uh, talk to you and see you, and I feel really privileged to be here. It's a oh, really nice. nice honor. Yeah, it's really exciting. Cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, uh, I'm so happy that you've like made... Uh, Three, three films since the last time I saw you. Well, actually, well, well, two, yes, and then the third one is actually where, uh, we're in, where we're getting that prepared. We're getting that okay. ready. We're, we're aiming to shoot that uh, this year and early Whoopsie. part of next year. <laughs> ah, yeah, you have a you have a trailer for the yes. one we're going to look at today. Yes, that's right. Yeah, yeah, it's for uh for my new one, Sacred Hearts. That's the uh, that's the new one that, that that we're working on right now. So. Did you uh, did you write the screenplay for this? Yes, I did. Yeah, and um, actually, uh, I've been working on this on the on this story for eleven years. And, um, wow. Yeah, and uh, next year will be twelve um, years that that I got the idea. Years. Yeah, you know, and um, things just ha things come when um, when the right whenever the right time uh, will tell me it, uh, it will. And so um, I feel really excited. Very. Um, uh, very honored to finally be getting this up and going and uh, so far we got a great cast we have crew members and we're still looking for new crew members and uh, we are um, just getting we got we got the project up on Kickstarter and uh, we're just right now this month we're just aiming for mostly promotion and for uh, raising money for the for the project so um, it's gonna be um, it's gonna be quite a quite an experience and uh, <laughs> it's, and I'm looking forward to it so Mm -hmm. I'm just noticing in looking at uh, YouTube, there are a few uh, Sacred Hearts trailers at the moment. Well, if you want to find the oh, the Sacred Hearts trailer, I know is it is that <laughs> is that odd or what? No, you know, I mean, I've I've I'm learning so much about YouTube and 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 putting things up online that um, the fastest way for me to get to find the the video and actually I um, can pass you the um, 
my name, my, my YouTube name, okay. right here. So you could just type in this. I get back. Actually, Arma, back. It's, a, it's actually Blue Mondo 7 slash 7. Of course, I'd, it's blue as in B L U E. Yeah, no, it's actually B L U. Okay, I have Blue Mando. B L U M A N D O O. Number seven. Seven? Yeah, and then space seven. Oh, uh, like an underline? Uh, no, you just, just tab the, the space bar and type in seven. Okay. Duh, Jennifer, get it together. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have Blue Mando. Seven, um, and it is not doing what I want it to do. It's asking me to sign in. Um, well, um, what I could do, I actually can just, I could, I could show you this right here. I, ha I have the, the name, the, right. correct, the, the correct name right there. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Why is it doing this? Uh, we should have put this in my hard drive. I guess I didn't know. Oh, it's because you just recently put it in, huh? Uh, yeah, I, I posted the video up on uh, on my YouTube page uh, just yesterday. Okay. Yeah. So it seems like it, so. Are we gonna sign in? Um, it, actually, just in the in the search area, you could just type in the the name and then you know my my blue Mondo seven seven name and then Sacred Hearts right next to it, and it pops up. Okay. <laughs> yeah, these other films are actually called Sacred Heart. Oh, so okay. yours is different. Mine's plural. <laughs> yes. Yeah, and um, yeah, and, and and with this one, I hope to. Um, I hope that this one. Giving us the, problems. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, so, um, what I'm gonna say is that we should. Um, so this is going to be hard for people to find anyway right now. Um, so let's do let's do uh, this. Let's sign in as you and then okay. get to your account. Is that cool? Sure. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm sorry. It's uh, at bay back here. You know, a lot of people use uh, these computers for shows and um, so um, oh it says choose an account uh, can um, I'm sorry mm -hmm. I, I'm not getting it to the ways you're oh. telling me oh okay <laughs> so um, if if we could uh, talk about it I could, I could talk no to no you no I want it. to show it yeah. <laughs> I was just going to ask if you could sign into your Google go to your account and open it oh sure and then okay. meanwhile I'll I'll speak a little bit and then and then um, and then we'll see it okay okay Great. sounds good yeah I'm so sorry and I, I could put that on but oh. yeah um, that's the thing about these live shows it's uh, it's uh, it's an improv always and um, not always. I mean, I'm I'm like saying in in terms of um, some uh, problems that we have on the um, with the computers, and um, yeah, that's the first thing that we learn in studying video is there's always going to be something that's going to surprise you, and um, so that has happened just now. But there it is. We have it now, and um, Armando is uh, ready to, and so we're going to go to our friendly YouTube and uh, put a full screen. Hi, my name is Armando Euclid. I'm the writer, okay. producer, and director of the upcoming independent... You started too fast. Hi. My my stop. Okay. Let's see the image. I want. I just want to check um, how well we're hearing this. Uh, probably okay. Armando Euclid. I'm the writer, producer, and director of the upcoming independent film Sacred Hearts. Sacred Hearts is a story about a young black seminarian named Gus who gets involved in the murder mystery surrounding Rose, 
a white transgender female artist mm. who falls in love with. The story has taken me 11 you. years to get from the page onto the big screen. Our cast includes Claire Farley, who recently appeared in the National Geographic docu docuseries American Transgender. We have Michael Yamaguchi, who recently co-starred opposite Dwayne The Rock Johnson in San Andreas. And we also have Aria Villajan, who recently won this year's Miss Premier Continental Beauty Pageant. This story has comedy, drama, romance, action, and mystery. It covers a variety of subjects, including interracial love, the transgender community, and the Catholic Church. But more importantly, Sacred Hearts is a story about how self-acceptance is the key to a happy life, and that no matter how you choose to live your life, we're all a product of God's love. We're going to go into production starting in October, and we will conclude in January of next year. But we need your help. The money you donate will help finance our film, and in return, you will receive an advanced copy of the DVD as the film gets theatrically released next year. This project is a very personal project for me. It's my way of paying tribute to the city of San Francisco and the people who live in it. So let's do it, you guys. I'm excited. My cast, my crew, we're all excited. And I want you to be a part in the creation of this incredible movie. And now it's my privilege to introduce to you the first official teaser trailer for Sacred Hearts. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoy. This is for Kickstarter. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Okay, hello. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, oh, it's back to me. I need to put this back to me and Armando. <laughs> oh, so. Yeah, yes. Uh, I guess our woman is the transgender person? Yes, she is, yes. Yeah, her name is Claire, um, Claire Farley, and uh, she's a... Um, She's uh, a well-known um, actress and uh, in the Bay Area. She's also done a lot of TV and um, she's done a lot of um, social work. And um, but she's just a very, uh, very talented lady, and I'm just very honored to have her on my, uh, on on my project. And uh, she's really, really great, really very sweet, sweet person. Now, um, yeah, because the male uh, actor is very clearly male. I I think. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he's a he's he's a young you know he's a, he's younger than her. Well, no? yeah. The, the, there is an age difference between the the, the two of them. Is um, that part of the uh, part of the story as well? Well, the 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 thing about the story is that it tackles a lot of different uh, subjects. It mm -hmm. tackles interracial love. It tackles the transgender community, the Catholic Church, and um, and the main theme of the story is that self acceptance is the key to a happy life. As I said in the video. And that no matter how you choose to live your life, you know we're all a product of God's love, and that also includes how you define love. And love has no age, it has no color, it has no um, no social status. It's just um, it's really a story about bringing people together. And, um, and I just feel very honored to be working in a profession where I could bring people together of all different um, aspects of life, and um, and that. You know, I like to make people happy, and and I feel like right now this story I feel is very, um, I think it's 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 very needed for this uh, day and for for this time. You know, especially with a lot of the turmoil that we're going on right now, socially, politically, and um, I just felt like this is the right time for me to to tell this story. And uh, and so far, you know, I mean, the the reception I've gotten has been been very positive, and um, but we still want to I still want to get that the word out there for this project and uh, get more people engaged in it because um, it's like I said in the video it's it, it's my way of paying tribute to the city of San Francisco and then what better way to do that than having the people uh, come in and contribute to this and be a part of this uh, of this movie so because um, 
it's 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 a city that has given me so much and i and i, and I just want to give this is my way of saying thank you and uh and showing people that the beauty that the city has and with its people and its uh and the locations that we have oh so um did you shoot it all on site here in san francisco uh we're going to be shooting that uh, shooting it uh, on site, uh, we, we with some exceptions uh, in San Jose and maybe in the East Bay. Sure. But uh, for the most part, the majority of the film is is based in San Francisco. And, I think um, that'd be cool to show part the Bay Area since a lot of mm -hmm. San Franciscans have been displaced. Yeah, yeah. You know, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of variety in, in mm -hmm. the city, and that's that's how how I wanted to present the story. I mean, there's there's a lot of there's a lot of um, there's a lot of different uh, topics that we talk about, and um, and as I said before, you know, it's not just uh, it's not just one thing. It's a multitude of different. Uh, genres. There's comedy. There's drama. There's romance. There's a little bit of action, some mystery, and uh, there's something for everybody. There's something for everybody in this in this movie, and so I um, I just hope that um, we can get um, people involved in this and, and and contribute in whatever way they want to. And uh, you know, you could be a, an extra on the film. We have a couple of uh, scenes where we need as many extras as possible, and um, and you know, we have. Um, we have a real great cast, and uh, and we're still getting our crew together, and um, and you know, for a mo for a project that's taken almost eleven years to make, uh, we're not we're not rushing this movie at all. We're gonna get this done in a very not not a very slow pace, but a good even pace. And I feel like mm -hmm. we're accomplishing that very very well. And nice. um, yeah, I have a question about um, the cross aspect mm -hmm. here in the beginning of the trailer. Um, because like so many people in this country, um, especially all the, the, most of the Republicans are not Catholic. Um, <laughs> however, a lot of the Latino community is Catholic. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, yes. My family, being from Ireland and Northern Ireland as Catholics, was very hard. So is something about Catholicism us, does it have anything to do with the film? Yes, absolutely, absolutely. And okay, uh, yeah, uh, Catholicism is not only plays a big part in the um, in the story, but also it plays a big part in my life. Um, I grew up Catholic, and mm -hmm. um, you know, growing up, I was always fascinated with um, with the church. And when I was mm -hmm. actually when I was in second grade, I actually had thoughts of wanting to become a priest. Oh. and I had um, always thought that the life of a priest would be fantastic. You live in this grand building, which is the church, and you get to wear these nice robes, and you get to drink wine and eat bread <laughs> every day. But obviously, that's not, that's not true. But <laughs> as I grew older, you know, I, yeah. th that changed. But, um, but no, I mean, I've, 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 this is, I'm not, I'm not, a, I'm not a, uh, a religious person, but I, I, am, I consider myself a, a spiritual person. And um, I'm very... Um, connected to uh, my Catholic faith and um, I go to church um, uh, not, not not every Sunday but uh, every every other Sunday and uh, I um, always found that my faith has gotten me through through a lot of um, hard times and yeah. that I uh, also want to pay tribute to that my faith with this with this project in some way and because right. with my with my character Gus um, a lot of him is well, actually, a lot of the characters I kind of broke myself up into a lot of the characters in this movie, uh -huh. and so there's there's a part of me in each one of the uh, characters that you'll see. Um, but for my lead character Gus, he's someone who has always been guided by his faith, and it leads him to a path that it may not be in what he wanted, but it's a path that he felt he feels that um, is the is is the right path for him in the end. So, so yeah, so the 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 story very much. Like me um, is about going on on a journey, a very unexpected journey, and it takes you to a place where you, um, it takes you to a place where you weren't expecting to go. But in you, in the end, you just find find that it was it was just meant to be. It was just meant to happen in that way. Oh yeah, great. <laughs> so what we're seeing is just it could be. Uh, there's a lot of twisted turns. Definitely in the story, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this, yeah. yeah this definitely, yeah. In this story, yeah, there's definitely a lot of, uh, not just with my two leads, but also with a lot of characters that you'll see in the movie, uh, a lot of their paths uh, lead them to 
places that they weren't expected to go to, and uh, a lot of them are discovering, rediscovering things about themselves, which is, which I think is pretty relevant to how a lot of people are. I mean, you could be, you could be in control of your life to a certain, to a certain extent, but then somehow life leads you in a direction that you just never weren't expected to go to, mm -hmm. and you, know, you just have to, you, you just have to figure out how you are going to navigate that and how you're going to be able to um, handle it. And um, and that's and that's basically what the story is about. It's about um, following, following your heart, your sacred heart. <laughs> and um, and actually, one of the reasons why I called the story Sacred Hearts is because I, I took that symbol of the Sacred Hearts of Jesus and Mary, and I uni and I made it into a universal symbol of the love that we as people all have inside ourselves. And it's also our truth. It's also our, um, it's our love for for one another, for our faith. And um, and I felt that was the right. The right title for this, uh, for the story. So, yeah, and um, yeah, so we're just uh, we're just uh, working really hard at this. I spent a, uh, all this year and all last year just getting this movie uh, made. Uh, had auditions and had uh, meetings with uh, crew members and uh, location scouts, and we're just um, you know we're just, we're just trying to keep the momentum going with this with this project and. Uh, and I feel that uh, so far things are going very well. And I just got to keep, just got to keep, stay positive and just know that things will, will come, come to place. Yeah, you definitely have an eye. I, I can, I knew that already. <laughs> <laughs> as, as you know, as you know me for the past two years, Jennifer, right? <laughs> yeah. No, you have some very good ideas, actually. Oh, and thanks. you have a couple other uh, short films on your yes, video, yes, on your Vimeo mm -hmm. account. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and that people can see. Definitely. Um, mm -hmm. And uh, Kickstarter, oh wow, we're going out in eight, seven seconds, Armando. Well, all I can say is that it was a privilege and I really enjoyed uh, coming here and um, thank you so much and I hope that we continue to meet more in this, in this platform. Me too. What's your last name? Well, for the, it's pronounced Ucles. But Ucles. Ucles, but for the Anglos, we pronounce it Euclid, <laughs> because <I see. laughs> some of them they can't pronounce the last name that uh, that that way. So I try. Ucles. I, yeah, Ucles, yeah, yeah, definitely. But for the but for the but for those who can't pronounce it, I just say, just think of the word useless. It's Euclid. <laughs> this oh, is a helpful way. To, no. <laughs> this is a helpful way to get them. But trust me, listen. I've, that I've had my last name butchered so many times. That it's just like it's. Not a big what, but if someone asks, you know, how do you pronounce it, I'd be happy to tell it to them. So, yeah, and how's <laughs> does uh, now you're you applied to Kickstarter in New York? Uh, well, I, uh, I applied to Kickstarter in New York. Aren't they in New York? Um, I bel I'm not quite sure actually. I just know are they in LA too? They must be now, Los Angeles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. They're, they're, they're I mean, they're all the way LA, New York. I mean, they're definitely international. Uh, now. Yeah, pretty mm -hmm. much. Yeah, and actually, it's, it's had a had someone reach out to me in Spain, uh, cool. expressing interest in it. So, That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, you know, so far, I mean, this is my first time do, using this, and I'm just doing. Just going with the flow, doing the best that I can with this, and oh. uh, just hope that uh, that things go well. That makes me happy oh, thank because you. I think of Planically as a pretty international show, mm -hmm. and um, uh, albeit you know my French is better than my Spanish. Mm. <laughs> I grew up uh, uh, with Carmelite nuns uh, and spoke Spanish from the age of six until the age of fourteen. <laughs> mm. So. I understand Spanish, and okay. um, yeah. I understand the the Carmelite nuns were from Spain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah, uh, <laughs> I, yeah, I'm still I'm still learning my Spanish. I mean, I can speak it pretty well, but I'm still um, there's certain vo words and certain vocabulary I'm still trying to remember and uh, trying to say. It. But but I think I, I could I think I can carry a conversation pretty well in Spanish. Um, just. I may have to pause in between just so I can remember certain <laughs> words, but, yeah. but I do the best I can. I, 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 feel, I feel more comfortable now than, than I did like 15 years ago. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm a work in progress in everything that I do. Do you, you've of course seen Almodovar's uh, Bad Education with Gabriel Garcia Bernal? Oh uh, gosh, you know what? I don't think I, I don't think it's I've seen It's miseducation or something like that? I don't think I've seen that one, but, but I do like a Pedro Al Almodovar's Almond, films. Yeah, yeah, I I, 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 yeah <laughs> I've seen him, uh, some of his other films, and he's, he's a great director. And uh, um, 
but that's one one that I haven't um, had a chance to see. I'm, I'm trying to catch up with a lot of movies that I have yet to see. Uh, I've just been so busy working on this that I'm just sure. uh, um, just been primarily focused on this. But I'm um, no, getting 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 back into uh, watching more films and getting inspired more uh, as I'm going through this journey of making Sacred Hearts. Just be, I say it just because it's set in a Catholic school. Yeah, yeah. In Spain. <laughs> yeah, you know, and, I'm, and, and like all like the rest of his movies, I'm sure it's fantastic, and I look forward to seeing it when I get the when I get a little more free time. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, and right. uh, yeah, but that's the great thing about art is that it's always there, and it's in people will discover your work for generations to come. There's no expiration date on it and nice. um so yeah it just feels great to be um like i said before it feels great to be working in a profession that um reaches people of all colors all ages and and there is no judgment on it well i mean when you watch a movie you could make your own opinion of it after sure. it's over but like it's like looking at any painting you you one person will look at a painting and they'll get a, a different reaction from the other person it's same yeah. thing with movies and and with music too so i mean it's um it's objective, but I think it's a positive objective. And again, you can go, you go actually learn from the people that you associate with when it comes to art. So, yeah. Um, I was going to ask, uh, who's doing the music on this one? You know, I haven't, I, I, I have, uh, ch I, I've reached out to a couple people right mm -hmm. now, but um, I haven't gotten to the, to that, to the, the score yet. Um, I still, like I've done so far in the, in this movie, just been looking at, uh, We're closing up, sorry. Oh, okay, okay. Sure, yeah. thank you. So we're going to, uh, <laughs> uh, this will be the end of our show, so okay, we can, great. uh, let's see, wave bye-bye to, thank you all, thank you very much. Hang on. <laughs> Uh, to to your camera, I think we can both get in there. Bye bye. <laughs> Good night. Thank, thank you very much, and thank you for having me. me. It's been a, a pleasure. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you, Armando. Okay, great. <laughs> Armando Uglias. <laughs>